Hey, hey. Good to see you. Good to see you. Hi. So, we uh, did a little too much at the wedding, huh? <laughs> Was, no, 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 no. I mean, they look good, and the good news is, I don't, think, good? I don't think you, you messed anything up, but this isn't uncommon. Did you, did you just uh, well, do I was, too much? I or? was like crying last night. I was like, no, I literally just walked down the aisle, but I okay. did like, remember you told me to walk a little bit on Saturday, so mm -hmm. it just doesn't just hit me yeah. on the, for the wedding, so... I was walking around a little bit, and I was like, okay, this is too much, so I went back to crutching around, you know, mm -hmm. they were calling me hop along at the wedding. So there was no cocktails <laughs> no, 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 no. you are a good girl? Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, didn't, I wasn't drinking. <laughs> well, she doesn't believe in drinking. Oh. And so, I mean, there was mimosas, but like, she doesn't believe in like, a lot of alcohol. I mean, it was like, a, it was a, oh, um, a brunch wedding. Let's take the integrity. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. It looks pretty good. If you, you know, if I saw, you know, more oozing, and yeah, you did bleed underneath the stereo strips, and these are going to come out in a couple days anyway, but I'm glad you came back. Um, I'm, I'm going to probably, once I take these off, retape number four down and pull five up. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to show you at the next visit how to tape these. But man, if you just kind of blur your eyes and, uh, and look at the toenails and the right, what a difference. It just looks amazing. Yeah, so I appreciate you coming in. But yes, once in a while I'll have patience and one mowed the lawn, believe it or not, and the, the pen was bent, so you're fine. I, okay. think you just, I think you just did too much. I was like, Dr. Boyd's going to kill me. And no, I was no. like crying yesterday. I was like, oh my God. Well, yeah, that's my line. That's my foot. <laughs> yeah. That's my foot. It's my foot until I'm done with it. Yes, ma'am. Like, yes, ma'am. I, like, I don't know. I always put a little ointment on there. Put a nice little wrapping back on there. Yeah, just, I would take some anti-inflammatory, stay off of it. It should turn the corner. And um, uh, you get to get it wet next visit. Well, my next visit is supposed to be Wednesday. Yeah, it is two more days. Mm -hmm. so usually I take them off right at 14. Um, with your age, and like some of these things can usually come out somewhere between 10 days and 14 days, I'm going to go ahead and do two days early. Okay. It's a double win because if I see anything gappy, I'll just redress it with more stereo strips. Yeah, let's go ahead and take it off. Okay. I think it was a good decision. That's right. It's only two more days. Mm -hmm. uh, let's go ahead and take this off. I was like freaking off. out. I was like, oh my gosh. And then I was yeah. like, I don't know what I did. I was like, I was like rambling on and on and on. And I was like, Dr. Moore's going to be very upset with me. Are you sure you can see me today? Can you please see me today? <laughs> Your staff's probably like, she's the most know. annoying person ever. <laughs> <laughs> Not ever. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah. Yay! Okay, when I used to do hair, I'd be like... No, you look great. In fact, if you look really close, um, there's your incision right there. There's a little bit of dry blood right there, but there's your, your sideways incision is here, mm -hmm. and on number three and four is lengthwise because we had to put that implant in. Mm -hmm. So I think this is a good choice. Yes, you look really good. But they are a little swollen right now, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been taking my naproxen, and I think I'm feeling more so the pain of, like, it, you know, getting in place, I uh -huh. think. Because I stopped taking oh, the tramadol. Oh, that's beautiful. That's all going to come off. Look at that. That just looks great. I know. Ah. I'm very excited. Okay, now, you can put a little bit of hydrogen peroxide on there. Uh, that little fizz, that little white bubbly stuff just means it's oxidizing the dead dry blood so mm -hmm. that'll kind of boil that stuff off mm -hmm. then you can put that your prosin or antibiotic on this area mm -hmm. not the scar cream yet and yes you can get this wet tonight okay great so can i start wearing should i still wear my boot yes let's protect it until these incisions are firm once you come back on on let's say they gave another the week at three. I think I'll have you come back somewhere between two weeks and, and another two weeks from now, which will be close to four weeks. I will go ahead and let you try a, you can do a flip-flop now if you want to, mm -hmm. and by the weekend, but keep it in the boot for probably another week, just to make sure the incisions don't rub on anything. Mm -hmm. And then we can get in something like this, or mm -hmm. more importantly, a soft running shoe. Okay. With one of those cloth tops on top. Okay, okay? I can do that. Yeah, awesome. So pretty! Oh my god! So what uh, what kind of shoes you gonna put this in? You have, what's your favorite dress shoe? Um, I love all heels. I love all sandals. So I bought these sandals already. 
Is this a, is these, this... Are, these are new. This is for whenever we're healed. I got these and I got some that had like some jewels and stuff. No, no Jimmy Chu or Manola, what's her name? Lonnie's. Yeah, you knew that. <laughs> you knew that. Um, I really want to get some red bottoms. And okay. did you know, did you know this fun fact? Yes. He makes his shoes. And the reason that he makes it this so like wide, like viewed out, because yeah. he likes this part of the woman's foot. And ah, like, where, um, no more hiding your foot. I know. Awesome. I'm cute. All right. We'll be good. I'll see you back in two weeks. Let me dress this back up. I'm cute.